Hello there, I'm Serenity Woods, and this is my channel. Charm up your life with some chamomile ginger tea. It's been raining a lot lately, and whenever the weather is like this for an extended period of time, I like to make something that's comforting. So I thought today we'd make some tea. It's very easy to make your own tea at home. As long as you have your ingredients, you can follow the 3 to 1 ratio. Three parts of your main ingredient, two parts of your secondary ingredient, and one part for your cherry on top. The ingredients that I'll be using today are chamomile, ginger root, and cinnamon. And I picked these ingredients because I wanted a tea that would help me to stay healthy, but also help me relax. You'll need something to steep your tea in. A pot and top will work just fine. The only ingredient that I'll be preparing today is my ginger root. When it comes to ginger root's medicinal properties, it's basically an anti-everything. Anti-inflammatory, antibacterial, antiviral. It's pretty amazing. Let's start by peeling our ginger root. This isn't absolutely necessary, but since we're going to be cutting our ginger into smaller pieces, I think it just makes it a little bit cleaner. Next, we'll be cutting our ginger root into small slices. I personally like my slices to be thin. If you don't want to slice them as thin as I do, of course that's no problem. In the end, it doesn't really matter how thick or thin the slices are as long as you have enough for your tea. Now, ginger is going to be my secondary ingredient, so I'll only need two parts ginger. Chamomile will be my main ingredient for this tea. It has a wide range of medicinal benefits, including helping with relaxation and sleep, as well as symptoms of the common cold and flu. So let's start making our tea. Since chamomile is my main ingredient, I'll be adding three parts chamomile. I have no real measurement, I just kind of feel it out. Next we'll add our two parts ginger. Now if you find ginger to be a little spicy, one part ginger is also okay. Our last ingredient, the cherry on top will be cinnamon. Also like ginger, it helps as an anti-inflammatory and is loaded with antioxidants. It can even help to fight bacterial and fungal infections. So now let's sprinkle our cherry on top with one part cinnamon. Our last step is to simply add some hot water. Once we're done, we can cover our pot with our lid and let it steep for about 10 minutes. Once it's ready, I always like to give it a good whiff and just enjoy all of the aromas from my tea. Now it's time to strain our tea and prepare it for serving. I have a nifty little strainer and I can fit it perfectly into my teapot.
I made a relatively large batch because I'm going to be sharing this tea with my family. We've been pretty stressed lately and I want to give us something to relax. And I like to garnish my tea with some cinnamon sticks, mostly because I think it looks nice. And voila, there you have it, homemade chamomile ginger tea. So find some time, sit down with your family, and share a cup of tea together. And take time to relax and enjoy each other's company. And of course, always remember the little things. Thanks for watching.